What's up YouTube, Maggie Tutorials here. Today I'm going to show you how to use extra mouse buttons on a mouse, gaming mouse, or pretty much any mouse that has side buttons more than the standard left, middle, and right key. In my case I'm using a Gigabyte mouse like Gigabyte M86 something or other, I'm going to do a video on it later. But you know, it has side buttons for games, a lot of other Razer mouses and or mice, whatever, have a lot of buttons some even have 12 logitech mice all that sort of stuff they have lots of buttons but except for maybe logitech and sometimes razor the the drivers even the ones that you download from the website are really bad especially the gigabyte one it's horrid it doesn't let you customize it all it's like back forward or scroll wow thanks yeah so um a program that you can use to modify these is X mouse button control. It's very, very, very helpful. Really nice, lets you pretty much make any mouse button, any other mouse button, any, pretty much anything, yeah. Uh, or any key on the keyboard, which is what I like to use it. So just download the link in the description, of course. Download it, install it, it should run automatically. Uh, you have to right click it in the system tray and click setup. And that'll open up this window. You won't have anything at first. Uh, no window profiles. You won't have anything set. It should say no change. Don't enter or in. Don't change the mouse button. In my case, I have changed the fourth and fifth mouse button. The way you can know what mouse button it is is if you come over here to a place that you can't actually click anything on. When you hold a uh, mouse button down, it will highlight it. So in this case, the left mouse button, right mouse button, the middle button fourth key uh, or fifth mouse button wheel up wheel down and then if I had tilt then it would tilt so uh, I wanted to change the mouse button to be left control because that is the zoom in Minecraft so I can zoom in um, I all you gotta do is drop down the menu and click simulated keys you can do this for literally any key any F1 F2 function key a volume up volume down even if it's not a key something like that you can do plus minus back forward stop all this is down right here the web browser keys crazy stuff like that all you gotta do is type in exactly what it says so the modifier keys control you gotta type R control or L control for uh, left right so in my case I just have intra custom keys squiggly bracket L C T R L another squiggly bracket then you can choose um, what type of way to control and then let go of it so it's just as if I was doing it with the keyboard except all I have to do is click it once as you can hear and it's as if I'm still holding left control down so that's very helpful you know you don't have to put a bunch of stress on your hand trying to grip stuff as I have a death grip but you can do nine different things so as the mouse button is pressed as it's released during so like when I hold it down it does it like normally um, until another thread as a mouse button is pressed or released so until another button is pressed I'm not really sure how you would use that repeatedly while the button is pressed down so it's like in out in out in out um, you can do crazy stuff just pretty much uh, look in the FAQ figure out what all this sort of stuff can do you can do oops you can do multi keys so like control alt delete it's, it's pretty advanced you can do this for any 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 button on your mouse doesn't matter if it's left click it's not like you can only do certain things uh, you can do alt tab activate monitor power saving back in web browsers and explore pretty much anything that'll let you go back you can close copy cut double click with it you can um, press enter with it you can launch your email client uh, you can also change stuff like you can mute stop play pause music uh, will wheel tilt right and left new new window open the control panel and explore open the run open the web browser paste redo undo all sorts of stuff so that's very helpful if you are using uh, Photoshop or word a bunch and you don't want to do keyboard shortcuts this is basically just replacing the keyboard shortcuts so it's very 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 helpful if you have something crazy like that also the last thing is the settings you can just say, change things like the mouse speed and bypass all actions when scroll lock is on so if you want to completely turn everything off without having to close the program do hickeys like that 
just click OK and click apply and then your keys are set you don't even have to restart any game it works fine so that is pretty much how to set up extra keys on a gaming mouse thank you for watching if you enjoyed this video be sure to give it a thumbs up support me with the links in the description and if you want more tutorials subscribe